So, my brother just called me. It's early Sunday morning. He just called me to come and uh, help him with a deer. And uh, I was like, what's the big deal? It's a deer, right? Like, okay. Anyway, so I uh, got over here. He sent me pictures and I'm like, whatever, okay. It's just some deer or whatever. No big deal. Okay, look at this fucking deer. Like, the antlers do no justice to this thing. Look at it. What's it? Four by four? Yeah. Very little mass. Hold that up, Ray. Look, it's, it's, it's decent. But look at the body on this thing. Look at the neck. Look at the neck. Like, we were planning... I was going to hunt here. And... So we were gonna gut it somewhere else so we didn't contaminate the area. But it literally is, I'm videotaping this because it's literally too big. It's too heavy to lift into the truck. We tried with this board. We tried lifting it with the sled. We tried all different things. And we're at the point where we might have to gut it here or drag it somewhere, but. I don't know. It's ridiculous. Ray, tell us about the hunt. Um, I was just sitting in my little spot and it was quiet for about an hour and a half. And then a smaller deer came out and I was just watching it. I know there's a big deer in this area. I have a trail camera picture. Maybe Victor will link it or put a post, a picture of it or whatever. So I, uh, I was watching it and then a couple minutes later uh, this guy came out and they were at 30 yards just like grooming each other, licking each other's necks and it was the weirdest thing. I've never seen that before, especially this time of year. I mean it's like October 24th and uh, you know they sparred just a bit and then you know they started to go their separate ways after about 15 or 20 minutes I was waiting for the bigger guy so I was gonna pass on this deer and uh, in the end I decided I didn't have a lot of hunting time available to me so I figured I would just take it because it's meat in the freezer but it's I, a lot of meat in the freezer yeah when I walked up on it the blood trail was just huge and then when I got to it I couldn't believe it like it's by far my biggest big woods buck yet by by a lot and Victor's right, the antlers are decent, but the body on this deer is so huge, it is unbelievable. Get down next to it. I have a trail camera video of this deer too, and I was telling my brother that, you know, oh yeah, he'll probably be good in a couple years. This deer is probably on the decline, just based on his mass, and like the antlers are still good, but they're smaller. But, like, look at this deer. Unreal. So I don't know how we're going to get that in the truck, but I'm going to set the camera up. It's and got a bunch of junk in his... Yeah, I saw. I noticed that. It was must have been raking some grass. I heard one raking a tree earlier oh, yeah, that in the could morning. Be, that could be bark, right? That is bark for sure. Yeah. yeah. Aspen. Well, this is I'm going to... That's, that's the, the exit. exit. Do you yeah. want to flip it over to show the entrance or what? Honestly, no. <laughs> it's like right here on the entrance. It just... Okay. Well, I'm going to try. I didn't, I didn't, I was coming here to help my brother pull a deer out of the bush. I, the pictures really didn't do any justice. I really didn't think it was big like this. And, uh, 
Yeah, I was going by the antlers. Mistake. It's probably 250, maybe more. Pounds? Yeah. Yeah, it's live weight. It's big. I'm I'm like 200 pounds, so that's definitely way bigger than I am. So yeah, it's up there. Um, I don't have a tripod or anything. I'm just gonna set this up in a wedge it into a tree, I think, and see if we can get some video of us trying to load this thing. It'll be hilarious. Maybe that tree right behind us here. We'll see. Okay. Anyway, let's do that. All over here. Found so many of them already. Deer is as big like it's so big. Anyway, let's get this out of here. I gotta go. one's still out there. I'll be going out next weekend. That's what happens. They die quick when you blast the heart. It's destroyed it. You can't even eat that anymore. <laughs> 